How have you found Kimi on his uh, on his return to Ferrari? Uh, pretty much the same animal he always is. Completely phlegmatic, um, and uh, very difficult to um, to get him overly excited. But he's he's just got in the car, pedalled it round the track, not not put a foot wrong as he as is always the case, and uh, is giving us feedback about what we need to do to make it better. And as always with Kimi, he doesn't talk a lot, but he's got incredibly soft hands and he'll tell you very accurately what the car needs to do to go quicker. Mm. Oh, okay, interesting. So you've now got a clear idea in terms of now systems, in terms of the braking, acceleration, or setup. Is that what you're talking about? Systems is more our deal. Uh, he, the systems cause the car's balance to change as it goes around the lap. So he describes the balance and then we modify the systems or the front wing or the roll bars or whatever. But uh, he's very, very clear about where the car needs to be changed. Right, with the golden nugget, I suppose, as Kimmy just over your shoulder asking if he's got anything else, commitments for the rest of the day. With the golden nugget, I suppose, being making everything completely seamless. Is that where the performance is going to come? Making the errors come in and braking and everything just, just feel like completely seamless? Well, that's... Um that's one part of what is many, many parts to be done before Melbourne. I'm, you know, we've arrived at these uh, these precious winter tests in previous seasons, and it's been full. It, you know, it's been how we're going to get it all done in time. On top of that, there is an awful lot of new functionality to get proven out, a lot of code to write, a lot of code to prove out, and uh, and that's it's just a very busy job. In addition to doing all the normal springs, roll bars, cooling, reliability stuff. You're happy so far? Yes, it's been a good